Hi everyone, this is a training video created for your convenience and quick reference. We're going to give you a run through on how to open and close your new step deck tarp system. Step one is we start with these Velcro flaps at the kick. They are attached with a bungee. You should detach the bungee. This will keep it out of the way while you are opening and closing the tarp system. It is important to remember with all these steps to replicate them on both the passenger side and the driver's side. We're going to go to the back door now where we have a new feature. The rain flaps still open the same as all of our previous systems, but now there is a locking bar that is inside the rear door. The difference here is we've added a small piece of UHMW. You only have to apply some downward pressure and the bar will pop out. This new feature will put the pressure on the bar instead of the Velcro. This will help your Velcro last longer. For this video, we're going to use the rope and pulley system to complete the opening of the back flap. There is, of course, the option to use the crank located at the side of the trailer if you need to get the rear door onto the roof of the system. In regard to our ratchet posts, these are going to be the exact same as all of our other tarp systems. You still must take the tension off at the rear before you start to open the front. The big difference between the flats and the step decks is what you need to do to roll the system forward. You're going to take the front lower deck cart and ultimately attach it to the cart at the very front, which is currently attached to the headboard. The goal is to get the connection arm to lock in place. You'll see how it locks in nicely when everything is positioned correctly. Once you ensure that the locking arms are connected, you can proceed to the front of the trailer where we have a new air setup. Let's take a closer look at this new feature. First, we start by rotating the lever. Now you've unlocked the front. We can also see the connection arm is in place and locked in with the pin. You are now okay to proceed with rolling the tarp system towards the back of the trailer. Remember, any Eagle tarp system can be operated from the ground, keeping you safer. Once you've got the entire tarp system to the back, your whole deck is now exposed. Loading your upper deck is easy and more accessible. When you're done loading, then it's just a matter of rolling the system back towards the front of the trailer. Notice the smooth transition between levels. You're going to love it. Now that you have the system at the front of the trailer, you're going to rotate the lever in the opposite direction to lock it in place. The front cart is now locked to the headboard. Disengage the lock arm to separate the front cart from the transition cart using the spring bolts on both sides or the quick release rope, depending on your system. You are now okay to proceed with rolling the tarp system towards the back of the trailer. It's important to note not to drive while the system is pushed to the front of the trailer. The drive tires of your truck will knock the system off. We'd like to emphasize again, do not drive your truck while the system is open. Besides this critical difference, everything else is the same on any Eagle tarp system. You will finish off at the back of the trailer just like any flatbed tarp system. You'll tighten the ratchet, tighten your straps, and tighten your rear door. Now you're ready to go. I hope this video on how to operate your Eagle tarp system on a step deck trailer was helpful. Thanks a lot for watching.